Hey guys, Uncle Ray. Welcome to another episode of the Crypto Bellwether. Today, hey guys, Uncle Ray. Welcome to another episode of the Crypto Bellwether Fireside Lessons. This week, I was reminded of a lot of different lessons that I've learned over time. Now, remember, no matter when you're watching this video, these lessons are pretty much timeless. And if you pay attention and learn these lessons, they will help guide you with your trading and your investments over time. Now that being said, I'm not a financial advisor and I would tell you to consult one. However, pretty sure you're not going to find one that tells you that you should be trading crypto. That being said, let's get to it. The first lesson is anytime there's big numbers coming out or a big uh, meeting or uh, someone's making a speech like the Fed or say a president, you need to just hang tight. That's lesson number one. Don't panic. Don't do anything rash. Just hang tight. And over time, that'll help you. Lesson number two is pretty much it's already baked in the cake. What does that mean? Well, you may have noticed that we got some really negative news. However, the market didn't fall apart. Well, why is that? Well, we pretty much traded down to sideways and lost about 10% or maybe 15% depending on the market for the last week because the market knows the market already pretty much already knew what he was going to say so it was already baked in the cake and that's a, that's a lesson that you need to understand the market's not going to react hard one way or the other unless there was a surprise in the conversation now lesson number three is if you're going to trade cryptocurrency you have to understand that Bitcoin has a direct correlation to a healthy stock market. For Bitcoin to really rally, we need certainty and positivity, positivity in the stock market. And wherever Bitcoin goes, goes the other cryptos as a general rule. So that's lesson number three. Now lesson number four is being that the market is in a bull market and it's overall pretty positive. Now it's not positive from good fundamentals in my opinion. It's only positive because the Fed is printing so much money and devaluing the dollar that all asset classes are flooded with money. With money. So there's no other way for it to pretty much go but up. So, if you think about it, there's no reason why we don't continue the trend. Now, lesson four and five go kind of hand in hand. Lesson number four is we should continue the trend upward. But we're going to need a catalyst. We're going to need something, some good news, something to kickstart us. And believe me, the big boys, the whales, the, the banks the hedge funds, the big money, they're going to create a catalyst or a story that gets this market moving. Which leads us to number five. They know that the average person doesn't understand what just happened. All they heard was negative news. And they're sitting there thinking, if they haven't already gotten out, they're thinking, wow, there's no reason for us to rally. We're probably going into a bear market. So there's a good chance that they can run those stops with just putting a little heat on the markets, say, early Monday morning. Now, I don't know what's going to happen, but I know it's common that for this market to continue before it does, they're going to push it down, and then they're going to leak out some type of positive news no matter how slight and then we're up and running back again and you've missed it 
So hopefully you understand what four and five were. Number four was there's going to be a catalyst and number five is basically they're going to probably push the market against the average guy. Anyway, those are the five lessons I hope uh, that you have a full understanding of. I try to simplify things as much as possible. And if, you, uh, if you've learned those, they're going to repeat themselves over time and they'll help guide you in your investments and your trading. Again, not a financial advisor. Anyway, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. We want, to, want you to be part of this community. Hit that bell so you won't miss any of these videos. Hit the like button. Share with like-minded people. Leave some comments and come back. We really want you to be part of this.